Hi, I'm Hakan and I'm one of the head instructors here at the Australian Martial Arts Academy. Today I'm going to be showing you how to hold a fist correctly. Now this is one of the most fundamental techniques in martial arts and it's required uh, in self-defense techniques, in blocks and in punching and striking as well. This is what we teach for our youngest kids all the way through to our adults, so let's get right into it. Step number one, how we like to teach this especially to the younger kids is we like to get them to open their palms just like this with their fingers nice and tight close into each other. Now from here, we get to roll the four fingers that are in front, back, into our palms, keeping them nice and tight with as little space as possible. The thumb then rests over them, just like this. And then we pivot, and that's how we hold the fist correctly. Now from the side, from here, our fingers are out, we roll them in nice and close. The thumb rests on top of those four fingers, and they look just like that. Now what are some of the common mistakes people make when they are uh, making a fist? And what they do, uh, a common mistake that I see is where they put the thumb on the inside of their fingers just like that. Now this can be quite dangerous because you can break your thumb or you can inflict pain on yourself. So that's, a, that's an, an, error, an error we want to avoid. Another common mistake that I see is when people rest their thumb along the side. While this may not cause any pain, it's not the most effective and efficient way to hold a fist. Right here on the bottom is a natural way, it feels comfortable and it allows you to strike with the two knuckles in which, in which you want to do when you are throwing your punches. And that's how to make a fist correctly.